Hey guys, it's um, Shiragane, and now we are here with Dio, and I'll be showing you his exploits, his skills, and combos. And Dio is a very rounded character. I did bring a Joestar into the fold just to show out the um, the high effect and his self regeneration and his blood drain and so on and so on. And since his time stop does have a long cooldown, I'll be showing that as well. And I'll get into more detail with the time stop because his time stop is vastly superior than Diego's. So I'm trying to make a cannon with the costume as you can see. But um at first glance, um um Dio's new set is very confusing. But we all love Dio. Some of you probably got the game just because of him. But He's one of the best characters in the game due to fan service and Araki loves him. And his first, we'll go for his first skill and it's Triangle. Yokoriwa is a world. And this is instantaneous. And it has remarkable range. And it's really fast. It's like some people cannot predict this. And you can actually link this with the combo. But it will not go that far. It will actually link to the intended target. In the R2 version is the same thing, but it just goes further. So for instance, let's do it on Avdal. He's right there. And this actually stuns people, it makes them go down. Even the triangle version as well. So you can combo out of this, for example. Yeah, see it's glitchy. Sometimes it does go behind them. And that's how far it can go. So let's get up in better ground. You can do combos like this. And that's his square square triangle, the re ya thing. <laughs> so yeah. This does glide, so if you want to go over obstacles, this is what I always do. You can just glide over things. And it is just great. And he does have a knockdown in the air, square triangle in the air. It's very fast. And he has a regular square square square. And we have ice cream. Which is amazing, so we can actually go right into time stop now, but I'll save that for last, because why not? And his square skill is his barrage. It does a lot of damage, as you can see, and knocks them back at a fair amount. And his circle skill is one of his best skills, because it actually teleports him. And it's fast, and it's sudden, and it can confuse people. So yeah, that's that as well. And his X skill is the knife throw. He throws knives, and the X version of it, the advanced version, the L2 version, um, does more damage. And if you look near Abdel's health, you can see the shoes with the arrow going down. That means his base speed is now reduced. And this is his regular combo. And he has a square, square, square triangle combo as well. And that basically makes them knock back, and they cannot um, force themselves to get up like a regular square, square, square because they are spinning out of control. For example, if I do square, square, square. He just falls back regularly, but he can actually recoil from that. But with the square, square, square triangle, they will spin out of control. And they cannot recover from this. Now, if you, um, it's kind of weird because if you look here, it doesn't say that how to do priority time stop. It doesn't say, okay, if you drain this certain amount of blood, it, you will take priority. No, it does not tell you. So if I drain Avdel's blood, Okay, now I have one stack of blood drain. And let's say I'm damaged, for instance. My health will slowly regenerate faster, but it lasts for a very short time. Then I drain Avdel's blood again. So that's two stacks. And if I drain Avdel's blood again for the third time, I will now be able to do a priority time stop. And it'll be like that. It'll show a cutscene, but it'll be the entire time. Everyone will be focused on Dio. They cannot move. They can't do anything because they cannot see their character, so yeah, that's kind of confusing. So, now we have um, two stacks of Avdel blood and a Joestar blood. If we drain Joestar blood, it automatically gives us four stacks, so now we'll get to six stacks, and now actually give us now a longer time stop. So if, Dio, uh, if Joseph can stand still for a second, now we're going to get high off this. And our health slowly inches. Seeing as see it regenerates faster in the whiteness. So now he, um, Dio's high. He's crazy. 
and he's an idiot now. And now all of our skills are basically a tad bit stronger. Don't get me wrong, they're not all that, but now they are stronger because he's high. And his health, you can't see it, but it does slowly inch towards maximum. So, of course, Dio can throw everything and anything. But, to be honest, um, Dio, part 3 Dio, is actually the slowest throwing item user because, I don't know why, but Phantom Blood Dio throws items way faster because he holds it himself. Because now, since he has a stand, he's very lazy. So, again, just to do it with that, this is instant. So, I can actually, for instance, he stops for a second. If I throw knives at him, he's going to be knocked back for a second, and that's enough time to do another attack with that. So now let's stop time. If I were to knock him down and stop time, see the priority? Because we have Joe Star Blood and all the stacks, and the time stop is a tad bit longer. That's like seven, six seconds. And that's what it usually does if you drain. Uh, MP like another player's health two times plus Joe Star Blood to give you an extra four stacks will just make a priority time stop. Now no one can do anything with that cutscene, and that's just that's just how Dio is. Like you have to take advantage of draining blood. You have to drain blood every time, and you have to remember how many stacks you have. So just remember always go to six stacks, and you can do priority time stop. And yeah, like no one can do anything anything so no one can stop in or interrupt you during stop time so you'll be pretty much invincible during those frames so again we're gonna drain him off again suck him off again now we have four stacks and this does um, fill up the bar the meter in the bottom left corner and this refills actually let's do that again to show a better use of this so I'm just gonna waste you can only get high once, one per round. So as you see in the bottom of the corner, my um, the pink thing that's glowing, if I burst out of it, and that's gonna take forever to recharge. So if I waste my two green lights and I find a Joe Star, if I now drain their blood, this all comes refilled. And now look at the bottom, the bottom left, bottom left corner, that fills up as well. And the green light is supposed to fill, but I guess it just glitched out for whatever reason. So, of course, we now have four stacks of Joestar Blood because due to the high, and now we have five stacks. You cannot do twice a high per round, like I said. And now all we have to do is drain off Avdol one more time for a six stack. And now we can do priority time stopping. Now, oh my god, ice cream. Thank you, Orange Jesus, wherever you are. It's because of Dio. Dio always gets what he wants. So, and really, now let's try um, Dual Heat Rush. In Dual Heat Rush, he can actually combo into his knives. Well, he can always combo into his knives, but he can just combo faster into them. And you can spam anything. You can spam all your knives, your barrage. So, of course, you can do it this way as well. Like that. So let's restart his health, make him get enough fresh new health bar so invincibility frames won't interrupt us. Yeah, and his combos are glitchy, by the way. And of course, like I said in every video, AIs do not want you to have fun with combos because they ruin everything. Of course, that's a square square triangle. And that's just the best way because his regular square 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 is Jokerish. Like so, yeah. And just again, um, if you look at my X skill, I'm just going to waste it. And if you go in this green bar, see it fills it up. It makes the cooldowns faster. But it doesn't make them instantaneous just because that cooldown is already fast as it is. But those green things do help. And I got more ice cream. I feel bad because I didn't even time stop yet. So we're going to time stop. If we get up to three bars, I need three bars. So we can exploit this. And actually, um, about Dio, um, Dio's time stop, 
Um, Diego, you cannot hear him say the world. He's actually very silent when it comes to time stopping. But you can hear Dio say the world because he's cocky. But Diego's actually pretty smarter, but his time stop lasts less less time. And also, if you do not drain Joe Star Blood and you do not get high and you do not have six stacks, if you are on your final health bar, you can actually always do a priority time stop just because he's on his last health bar. That was good enough. <laughs> Oh, and by the way, you can do infinite loops with blood draining on world crash enemies. You can infinitely loop it. So now let's drain him for the final time. Oh, cool. There it is. There's one. Actually, oh wow, he just shanked after. <laughs> How mean. So again, with time stoppers, it's always best to stop time after your partner hits an opponent with a DHA. Okay, guys, just to make that clear. That's just the best way to use it, even though it does it is cheesy. You know. So again, let's um let's do a priority time stop. Okay, somehow it's not priority time for a reason, but you can just do a DHA and stop time. And it bypasses invincibility frames. So this is Dio, guys. I hope you enjoyed. I certainly did. And he's very easy. The world is over!